Every morning, the tree shrew's first activity is using the toilet. It's the only animal that has its own toilet. It poops into the mouth of a pitcher plant. This plant doesn't get angry. Instead, it provides the shrew a snack. Every morning, the pitcher plant opens the toilet lid to greet the little tree shrew. As to the little tree shrew, the first thing it does when it wakes up is look for the pitcher plant. The reason for their close relationship is because they have a special partnership. The lids of the pitcher plant's toilet secrete a sweet nectar every day, which happens to be the tree shrew's favorite dessert and its primary source of sustenance. After the tree shrew has licked all the toilet lids clean, it also leaves a carefully prepared gift for the pitcher plant. Although this gift may seem a bit peculiar, it's the pitcher plant's favorite food. In the continuous rain of Borneo's tropical rainforest, the gift left by the tree shrew is washed into the pitcher plant's stomach by rainwater. With nitrates from the feces, the pitcher plant can survive in the rainforest. Another type of pitcher plant is linked to bats. It's called the Herschel pitcher plant. Its curved shape helps bats effectively reflect ultrasonic waves, and its slender tubular body provides a safe roosting place for them. Although bats don't defecate, the sediment on their bodies can provide the Herschel pitcher plant with the nutrients it needs. There's also a type of pitcher plant that attracts ants to obtain the substances. The small pitcher plant secretes nectar under its toilet lid. When the nectar attracts ants to feast, the movement caused by rainwater hitting